Ah, creepy. Dear Tim and Moby, what is the atmosphere? Why is the sky blue? From Thomas. The atmosphere is made up of a mixture of gases, mostly nitrogen and oxygen, that wrap around the Earth like a blanket. Without the atmosphere, we wouldn't be able to live here. Those gases protect us by blocking out dangerous rays from the sun and making Earth a perfect habitat for plants and animals. The Earth's atmosphere has five layers: the troposphere, the stratosphere, the mesosphere, the thermosphere, and the exosphere. Atmospheric gases become thinner the higher up you go. The troposphere is the lowest layer. It's also known as the weather layer since rain, snow, and wind stick to this layer. The troposphere extends 16 kilometers above ground at the equator and 8 kilometers at the poles. From the top of the troposphere to 50 kilometers above ground lies Earth's stratosphere, where the temperatures increase with altitude. It starts out at minus 60 degrees Celsius at the bottom and then warms to about freezing. This happens because the stratosphere is heated from above by the sun's ultraviolet radiation. The ozone layer is found in the stratosphere. Ozone is a gas that absorbs harmful UV rays and protects us from too much solar radiation. Pollution has created a hole in the ozone layer over the South Pole, and that hole is bad news for the environment. The Earth's mesosphere is found starting at 50 kilometers above ground. The atmosphere reaches its coldest temperature of around minus 90 degrees Celsius in the mesosphere. This is also the layer in which a lot of meteors disintegrate from friction while entering the Earth's atmosphere. The thermosphere is the fourth layer of the Earth's atmosphere, and also the hottest. The air is so thin that not much solar radiation can be absorbed, and temperatures climb to almost 2,000 degrees Celsius. The Earth's thermosphere also includes the ionosphere, a region of the atmosphere that's filled with charged particles. Starting 500 kilometers above Earth, the exosphere is the highest layer of our atmosphere. It is definitely not stable. The atmosphere becomes very thin, and gas molecules can escape into space. All right, why is the sky blue? Well, light has different colors based on its wavelength. The gases in our atmosphere scatter certain wavelengths of light and let others pass right through. Blue light is scattered the most efficiently by the gases in our atmosphere. That's why the sky appears to be blue. The color of light that gets through our atmosphere most is blue. Therefore, we have a blue sky. Hey, leave that flight attendant alone.